Well, I think looking back over the years, photography, um, we were really struck by the relentless news cycle. A lot of the work that we saw was very challenging to view, but we were also really struck by the positive stories that we saw. And um, we wanted to make sure that we were challenging stereotypes as well in the work that we awarded. And we were aware that many of the photographers who are working are doing so in really challenging and almost unimaginable circumstances. And we really wanted to make sure that we were applauding their work. The World Press Photo of the Year um, is a photograph of a, an aunt cradling the dead body of her niece. It is a really profoundly affecting image. Once you've seen it, it's kind of seared in your mind. I think as well that, you know, because it's a photograph that doesn't carry a lot of visual context, it, it can act very em emblematically in that it works as a kind of literal and metaphoric uh, message, really about the horror and futility of conflict. And it's an incredibly powerful argument for peace. With all the winning images, we were looking for pictures that, you know, resonated beyond their, their original point. And we really kind of felt that this picture did exactly that. The winning story is about uh, a family living with a member who has dementia. It's actually a story that, uh, you know, we see played out all across the world. Um, it's been photographed in the most incredibly tender and intimate way and is, it really is a story of love and acceptance. Um, and we felt that when we were viewing the work that the photographer had really gained the trust of the family. It was an incredibly respectful piece of work. The long-term uh, award winner has a really distinct visual language um, which really um, helped it to stand out from many of the other projects that we saw. It feels that some of the images are so visceral, it really kind of felt as if the photographer had walked in the shoes of the people he was photographing. We felt that it was a real kind of masterclass in uh, combining a, a very distinct aesthetic with um, incredibly meaningful humanitarian journalism. In the open format um, is a really exciting opportunity in World Press to tell a story in a more expansive, deeper, nuanced way. And what this project does, it's first of all, it's about the war in Ukraine. Um, the photographer has used all the elements described, you know, incredibly dynamic photography that has a, a sort of thread of blue and yellow colours going through it, like the Ukrainian flag. Uh, there is really um, very moving poetry and also kind of engaging, emerging illustrations through the piece. It's an incredibly atmospheric account and I think really gives you the feeling of despair and confusion that people feel in Ukraine at the moment. Um, and I think it does speak volumes for a generation of young people.